wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Okay, you beautiful smiling friends, welcome back to the back of the semi truck and random question of the video from the previous episode that we just watched. When you get down and out, because of course the last episode was about frowning friends, what do you do to cheer yourself up? And a lot of times I play music whenever I'm feeling really that down and out myself personally. I got a few songs picked out, kind of like, you know, Everything is Awesome from the Lego movie, and then I got quite a few songs from a band called Nefex. Now, if you don't know who Nefex is, the song that you hear play at the beginning of my intros, they got copyright-free music, so I use a lot of their stuff, and they got a lot of stuff that pumps you up, too, so I use a lot of their stuff to kind of get me in a good mood, get me, you know, really hyped up and just ready to take on the day, so that's what I do, and I don't know, what do y'all do when y'all get down and out like the frowning friends and just kind of, you know, don't want to, you know, you just get down and out, so leave your answers down there in the comments below, and we are about to watch an episode entitled Charlie Dies and doesn't come back so from what I'm gathering from the screenshot that I see right over there that y'all see I'm presuming now that I'm seeing this screenshot it's a Christmas episode and Charlie's gonna be kind of you know like Scrooge was and gets visited from the ghost of Christmas past Christmas present Christmas you know, so on and so forth. Yeah, everyone knows the classic story of, you know, Scrooge and where all that comes from. So, well, not Scrooge McDuck. <laughs> but, yeah, that's what I'm presuming now because Christmas thing. I don't know. I can't really gather nothing else other than that. So, I'm going to go ahead and do this and we're going to hit this play button and just check out and see where we go from here. So, I guess with that said, we might as well be hitting this play button in 3, 2, 1. And I know it's a little bit earlier than normal, but you know what? And play. Oh gosh, I gotta put earbuds in if I'm going to Our watch it. Our story begins on Christmas Eve. At a yes, humble it is a Christmas episode. Friends, except for one nasty yellow one. Of course, that was Charlie. Charlie. Can you help me hang these lights up? Uh, yeah, just give me one sec, man. And... I got a last minute job for you. The job is for me, your favorite character, the boss. I just need a Christmas tree for the office. I'm I don't even have nothing to say to the boss. A Christmas adventure! What's up with you today, Charlie? He doesn't I'm like Christmas, favorite. obviously. I don't know, you just... I don't know, it seems like you're agitated or something. Al, are you affected by the, whatever, whatever's supposed to be happening? He doesn't even know what's going on. I just want to find a tree. Okay, so in other words, does that mean everyone else has to conform I'm just to saying that? It, I it's, agree. It seems like you're often in this mood. You don't like, always so have to be like positive and like cheery this. about every what, what freaking thing like, imaginable. What supposed to be? Well, it was the same with... I'll do it, I'll do it. I'll do it. And That's it's okay, going to fall on you. Just help me out, right? Something bad. And... Wow. Did not expect him to get that bloody. Okay. <laughs> so, you ended up in hell. Dude, if you do that again, I'm going to punch you. I'm not kidding. Well, you'll be here forever, Charlie, so get used to it. Where's the actual fire? All right, yeah, dude, all right, what's going on? Down. This place isn't what it used to be. To be honest, Satan's been down in the dumps lately and he has Oh gosh, they're Wait, going to actually help him. Like He's gonna have to go and friend. make <laughs> the devil leave, smile. I'll pierce <laughs> you with my Eve. Get out of here. Get out of here. Go away. Yeah, you made the little imp sad, <laughs> dude. You are not good at your job, Charlie. That seems a little bit unreasonable. I don't think you should be in hell for that. Um Grandma, you wouldn't happen to know where I could find <laughs> This Satan, is true, so that's a little you? bit unreasonable. <laughs> Just go down that scary hole right there. Christmas in H-E-double-L. You know, I'm vibing with this. Yeah, the damn and the demons. The nation for an exclusive. Yeah. 
Uh, hey, you got by the Cyclops. Hey, you were going through a lot of trouble to get over here to the devil. <sighs> okay, I'm almost there. I think the biggest surprises are behind me. Punch him. They, oh, you didn't punch him in the face. You just punched him in the stomach. You said you would Dude, punch him in the face. I was going to do that if you did that again. What's up? <laughs> Not much, dude. Uh, so we got the devil uh, just chilling out playing video games. Or something like that. Bullshit paperwork I've got to do, which I've been putting off. Just hire uh, somebody, you know, dude. All of it, the worst thing is, you know, I don't get paid until the end of my job, which is eternity. Oh, you know? man. It's, it's, it's eternity. That uh, would so I, I just suck. Don't care I just don't care anymore. Herb, good luck. You can come in. I'm just right over there. Yeah, right, yeah, <laughs> Salties. Right That's fine. Yep. Okay. North Yard Display, so the one next. Yeah, I did. Great, great. I forgot it. Cool. Just what I wanted. Exactly, exactly what I wanted, actually. Cool. Uh, you know. Yeah, whatever. Uh, anyways, as I, I say, feel it seems the like devil you're here. To do things because you're stuck I mean, in a loop of short I really, rushes. when I'm in that mood, everything ticks me like, off as well. Like healthier or something. I get it. Are you seriously criticizing me? No. <laughs> Hey, th yeah. <laughs> I was about to say, yeah, he was about to, he was, he's gonna smile. Yeah. Oh, well, I, I guess you're right. Oh, sweet. You forever, man. Forever. No, come on, dude. No, that is not fair. Be a devil of your word. Huh. That does really sound like Gilbert Gottfried. He must have recorded this before he passed we away. Here to celebrate the life of Charlie cool, Dunkle, cool. A noble critter who loved to live. Charlie, dude. What does it mean, Charlie? You with my everything. You could wear God's more. Man. Charlie, am I losing my? It's okay, Glove. If it's gone, where we? Um, did you like? Oh, okay. He's gonna reform, and he's naked. It's a Christmas miracle. Charlie. Be careful where your hand goes, dude. And so. Yeah. That is how you gotta be Charlie careful got in a situation back. like that. The because, end. yeah. It's actually real. And Christianity so, was right you all can along. actually Sorry. talk, Glib? Yeah. Merry Christmas, everyone. Ah, oh. Merry Christmas, dude. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So that was... Oh, gosh. I, I just... I don't... <laughs> I, I, I don't, sometimes you just don't know what to frickin' say, um, because this episode was another one of those episodes that's like, what the frick is happening, what is gonna happen next, first and foremost, we get Charlie, I thought, okay, obviously I was wrong about what it was going to be, such as the whole, you know, you know, ghost of Christmas past, present, and future, and stuff like that, <sighs> It wasn't that. It was Charlie actually died. <laughs> and he went down to hell and then he came back to life because he made the devil happy. And Gilbert Gottfried, of all people, had to come down and save him because he made a deal and a deal is a deal. So, yeah. There's that episode in a nutshell in under 30 seconds. <laughs> So, yes, this is, uh, it's not a horrible episode by no means. It's an inventive episode. Um, they could have easily trimmed out, like, at minimum a minute or two of the episode, though, because when they made the, no, actually, no, that delivery was fairly important because it showed the mood that the devil was in. And the mood that the devil was in was one of those moods where just everything freaking sucks and I get it like I said during the episode yeah I feel that you know I understand exactly where he's coming from because when I get in that mood I get so upset that everything ticks me off just like it ticks him off so I'm you know I'm there with him I'm feeling that, just like a lot of y'all understand that feeling as well, but for me, whenever I get in that mood, everything just goes utterly wrong, and normally, I'm staring out of a windshield, obviously, with being in a semi-truck, I'm staring out of a windshield, and everything that each and every person in front of me is doing is ticking me off to no end, so, 
when I say that the episode could have had about a minute trimmed, now that I'm rethinking it, and no, no, it, it, it needed that delivery because it literally showed that even the missing straw is just, it sucks. It ticks you off that much freaking more. So, yeah, um, I'm trying to think of more about this episode, but, um, in all reality, that's pretty much all I've got. <laughs> I want to say more so badly, but unfortunately, it is what it is. So, I guess i got to pass it off to y'all, and then I've got to think of a question for the video, and then after a while, not tonight, but, you know, tomorrow or the next day or whenever, and watch the last episode that we currently have going on. So, hopefully, this doesn't turn into a week-by-week -week show, because I am not going to focus on this show, you know, well, maybe I will. Maybe I would focus on, focus, I could have swore I just said a different word by accident. Either way, maybe I will focus on this a week at a time. I, I don't know, I don't know. Let me get called up to episode 9 first, and then I can start making decisions as to whether or not it's a weekly show or something like that. Either way, pass it off to y'all. Hit the like, tickle to subscribe, don't be texting and driving, and as Mr. Rogers always says. And I like you as you are. I do.